Hello guys, welcome back to my channel Rainbow Tales. Do you like chocolate? Well, I definitely love chocolate. But my mom does not allow me to buy any store-bought um, chocolate syrups and chocolates because there are so many preservatives and artificial flavoring agents as you can see over here. So these are not healthy and I wanted something that is much better than these store-bought items. So I was going to make some homemade chocolate syrup and I thought why not share it with you guys. So today I will be making a video on how to make some delicious chocolate syrup. This recipe is very easy to make and it requires only 4 ingredients out of which one is optional. So it makes it only 3 key ingredients and these ingredients are very easily available everywhere. You can also have the satisfaction of making this at home and you can eat how much ever of it you want guilt free because it is made at home and does not have preservatives. Now let's look at the ingredients that are required to make this amazing and delicious recipe. We will need half a cup of cocoa powder, one cup sugar and one cup of water and the optional ingredient is vanilla essence. Let's start making our chocolate syrup. I am really excited to make this and this is the first time I am making it on my own. Let's take a pan and turn on the flame. Make sure it is on medium heat. Next we will take our cocoa powder and put it in. Then we will take our sugar and put that in too. Now let's give it all a good mix. Make sure they mix well together. Now let's add the water. And mix it. It looks very delicious and I can't wait until it's done. smells very good. Keep stirring it till the sugar is dissolved and everything is coming together and after that we will boil for a few more minutes. It has started boiling now and it looks really good. You can stir it for two more minutes and then you can turn off the stove. Until then keep stirring it and taking out the chocolate from the side. It has started boiling now and um, you can turn off the flame. You can feel the thickness while you are stirring it. That's when you know it's done. So I am turning off the flame now. And I am going to add 2 drops of vanilla essence. This is entirely optional. Once again, my essence smells so good. Now it is all done and ready, and the consistency is thick. You can wait for it to cool to room temperature and then you can transfer it to a glass jar and refrigerate it. This will last for one month. If you want it to be more thicker then you can refrigerate it and wait for 2-3 to three hours and then you can have it or you can dig in while it is warm. Our chocolate syrup is ready and it looks dashing. You can use this with so many things. 
you can use this with your chapati roti you can use it with bread you can add it as a topping on your vanilla ice cream or any other ice cream you can also use it with cake too it will go really well so i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did then make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more useful content stay home stay safe and i will see you in my next video bye Uh, you can make for it to cool down to room temperature.